says September, but many retailers, churches, and cities are already planning for the holidays. And for one local community, the lights were set to go dark until the holiday spirit came a little early. News Channel 5's Tracy Carlos is live in the newsroom with this story. Lee, countless cities across the area are forced to tighten budgets because of the poor economy, and for Brunswick, that meant the lights out for the annual holiday display. The sparkling snowflakes, twinkling toy soldiers, and lines of lights that illuminate Brunswick Center Road during the holidays are in storage. After all, the holidays are still months away. But this year, this is where the decorations were supposed to stay, packed up and unplugged. One of the things that I presented to City Council was to not do the holiday decorations this year just because we were facing some tough financial constraints as a city. Like many cities, Brunswick has to cut costs, so the annual lights went dark. There's many things that we try to look at to cut, you know, cut back and, and save on expenses, and that was one of them that came up. But months before the holidays arrived, the spirit of the season has been ushered in by a local business owner. The owner of Excalibur Auto Body decided to spread some joy early by donating $10,000 to get the lights back on. We are very much surprised, very excited uh, that someone would, would donate this amount of money. Uh, it was a very generous act, and the, and the cities can be very thankful for that. And so the drivers who travel this road during the holidays will once again see the decorations lighting up the night sky the holiday season a little brighter, thanks to an early present from one man. Now, the donor, Mitch Rudolph, could not speak with us today on camera, but city officials say that he wasn't looking for publicity, that he did it out of the goodness of his heart. In the newsroom, Tracy Carlos, News Channel 5.